We are running out of food in our house. I'm gonna show you our freezer. There is nothing inside. It's just some horrible vegan sausages that nobody wants to eat. And plus me and JD, we are still eating this non-fat diet until my surgery. So if you didn't know, I'm losing my gallbladder. And until I get that surgery done, I can't eat any fat at all. Otherwise I risk messing up the surgery or something. How many days have we been doing this? Five days of non-fat, lots of soup, egg whites and salads with like some tuna and chicken, but we're kind of like running out of ideas. I wanna try other stuff. So we're gonna go look for other alternatives and see what we can get. We're gonna bring you with us, go to our Costco here in Canada, and we're gonna see what we can find. Zero fat stuff for me and JD and also snacks and fun things for the kids to eat while they're in school this week. All right, so we're here at Costco. We didn't bring the kids today. It's just me and JD because we got to do a major Costco haul. And when the kids are around, it gets very crazy. And it's actually very stressful. We're just going to go do our thing, non-fat grocery list, and oh. also snacks for the kids. Child-free, fat-free. Yes. Look how tiny they are. Cute They're that? so cute. Should we get them? Yeah, I'm gonna eat all of this in one time because I'll be so. Okay, let's get it. They're so cute. Ooh, this is zero fat, right? Yes, we have a yummy snack. No fat. Zero we can fat eat this. Is. Yay! Oh, zero percent fat. A little potato. Coming home. This has 18 grams of fat. For Can you how much? How much it would hurt? For two pieces? <laughs> oh my god, I would have to go emergency room. Turkey breast. If it's like this, it's one gram. For so four one gram slices. is like it's like a can of tuna. So I think this is good. Yeah. I was hoping that ground turkey would work, but unfortunately there is fat. Oh yeah, it's five grams. So yeah. it's not gonna work. One or less or close to zero, so yeah. that's not gonna work. I so last time we came to Costco, everything was blocked because of the curfew, the pandemic thing, except food and essential like pharmacy things. So now it's funny because everything is reopened. It's like having access to the whole world. Yeah, we get to see what, what else they have. Maybe they have stuff that we need that we don't know we need. Okay, I don't know if you guys are aware, but at Costco, there's a little trick. If you come shopping here, there's a, a trick and it actually lays in the price. The dot 49.97.99.00 means something. We'll tell you what it means. So then when you come shopping here, you'll know exactly where to get the good deal. All right. Anything in, that ends in 99 cents, regular price, full price. 97 cents, store manager deal. So look out for that. 49 cents, 79 cents. These are manufacturer deals. So these are lower than regular, regular price, okay? Anything that just ends in zero, zero, the manager wants to get rid of the inventory. So the most likely will be price lower too and anything with a star is discontinued, so could be priced lower, lower just because they want to get rid of it. Discontinues or manager price? Both. It's a manager discount, but it's also discontinued. Eight grams per bagel. I had no idea that one bagel had eight grams of fat. That's from him, right? For That's from him for school, yeah. And there's only 0.3 grams per pita. I mean, my, my doctor said aim for zero, but 0.3 is really close to zero, so. Yep. Oh, <gasps> torture. We used to eat these, this is so torture. good. Torture. I what? really want that. 15 grams per 28 chips. I used to probably eat double that amount in like one movie. This one is more. This one has more fat in it. But you know, honestly, I'm fat. not gonna eat that. Oh, you don't eat cereals anyway, right? Hey, this I time means it's for sale, that. right? It's gonna be discontinued. Yeah. What? Okay. Guess how much fat is in granola? Um, I don't know. I I I don't know. 15 gram. Yeah, 17 grams. Yeah, am I right? Wow. But you know what? That's probably good fat. There are such things as good fats, like an avocado. But because of my condition, we can't even eat avocado. So, so no, 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 good not fat even good fat. No. 
Wow, awesome mm -hmm. find, babe. Oh, we can yeah. make like fried rice. We could do omelets. White egg fried rice. Yay, awesome, thank you, baby. You want some poutine sauce, babe? Ah, give it to I'm me. I'm so upset. <laughs> you can't, you can't get that. Get out of here. These are zero fat. I haven't had dessert in like These five days now. That's okay, big. yay. For Charlotte? Yeah, Charlotte really has been asking me for fries for three days. What do you want, Charlotte? I want to go get me frozen fries. You want frozen? You like frozen fries? Are you going to eat them cooked or frozen? Frozen. You're going to eat frozen fries uncooked. Mm -hmm. That sounds... That's how I like them. That's what you want. Yep. McDonald's fries. So how does it like two fries kinds? Are gonna be like kind, I guess. That's McDonald's fries. Yeah, that's what she uh, wants. <laughs> <laughs> so Charlotte told me she wants to eat the fries raw, straight from the freezer, not cooked. That's her plan. Do you guys have kids who do that? Do you, does anyone do that? <laughs> I don't think it's really good. Yeah. That's what she wants. So we'll see. <laughs> So, ooh. five gram of fat. Ooh, look at what I found, guys. This has got, uh, where is the thing? There we go. This has got 0% fat. So we can actually put that on our chicken, on our fish. That is gonna be good. Yay, I'm so happy. We're gonna get really good meals now. And a bread? One banana bread? I think it's got only 1%. One, one gram. gram. Fat for one quarter cup. It's not bad. For a dessert? Are we pushing it a little bit? I don't know. Much? I'm scared. I really, yeah. I'm so scared. Because like, you, you can make like breakfast, eh? I know. But like my doctor told me zero gram. So I feel like I'm kind of like, well, when is close to zero gram? Yeah, gram? there's oil in there. I don't want to get All in right. trouble. Well, you know, there's way more stuff than I thought that are actually fat-free, I, I suppose. Uh, I mean, I, there's way more than I thought there was going to be. I'm so excited of all the stuff that we're going to be able to eat that are fat-free this week. You know what I found very weird, though, is like because we're eating, like, I guess, like, food that it's not really tasting good right now. I do miss the real good food. <laughs> I, I do feel better, but I miss a juicy burger and a poutine and this pizzas and all this stuff. I do have to say I feel better, but I did feel excited when I found food that was out of the ordinary and it had zero fat, and like the mochi. I know. You I was like, don't, don't. You just show them inside. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> so you already saw. <laughs> I felt the excitement of having mochi. I mean, when did I feel excited about getting mochi? I never. Everything is exciting. Yeah, because like, you know, we still have about four weeks of this to do. If you already know the story, you know the story. It's not for losing weight. Oh, yeah. It's because I have to get my bulk gallbladder removed. And until we remove it, we have to follow this diet. Otherwise, the surgery could be complicated. So it's so. zero fat, which is barely impossible unless you only eat fruits and vegetables for so far from what I figure it out yeah and you can't live only on that and the surgeon was like super serious about it like he pretty much told me like the risk of well what's gonna happen is the little stones are gonna get into the pancreas and, and then it gets stuck. it gets stuck and it gets, it gets, it gets more very complicated. complicated so it's a very serious thing so uh grace grace got it after your surgery i decided to support her Thank and also you, eating though, too you're welcome because if jd wasn't there like it would be so hard <laughs> So. No, I think it'll be the same. It's just like, I think it's, I, I just think it's normal. So yeah, so I decided to help her and support her on that. So I think it's very fun. I, I, at the same time, guess what? We're losing weight. Like I'm losing weight like crazy. <laughs> it's a good thing, right? Let's go home. Let's reveal you what we bought and the price. Yes. Okay, so this is what we got at Costco. We only got food this time. Like nothing else except for just food actually i'm i'm kind of surprised all the things that we could get that are zero fat for this diet so pita bread who knew that it was like non-fat awesome i'm gonna eat this little baby bananas how cute are they they're so cute right this thai kitchen sauce 
This is gonna make our chicken taste so much better and our fish, we've just been steaming tons of fish and chicken, putting salt and pepper and honestly, it's like not really tasteful, so. Oh yeah, never had this before, cauliflower rice. It's pretty much just like rice that looks like it's made out of cauliflower. I, I see a bunch of people get these, so I don't know if it's good or not, but we're gonna try it out. Comment if you uh, like that kind of stuff. In, in Canada, we get our milk in bags. And before, like I'm from the States, so we always get our milk, milk like in plastic jugs, but yeah, we get them in bags here. Up here, you have to have vitamin D. We don't get enough sunlight. This is essential. If you don't take this every day, like seasonal depression, yeah, that's a real thing here, so. Oh, and JD found this, so excited. This is a dessert, like mochi. I don't know if you know what it is. It's like this gummy thing and inside is this sweet stuff. There's no fat and it's the first time I've had anything sweet and dessert-like in like, a week, so I'm super excited about this. I grew up on this stuff, but it's so good. We well, have I've never seen those Captain Crunch. Oh yeah. These Captain are funny Crunch. looking Captain Crunch. The kids are gonna really like that. And of course, everything's in French on the package because we live in Quebec. We usually get white bread, so this is a bit different for us. This is whole wheat bread, less fat. It's gonna be better for everybody. Yeah, so Charlotte has been asking for frozen fries for like literally like a whole week now. She keeps opening the freezer and reminding me, hey, you didn't get your frozen fries yet. So this time we got her some frozen fries and she wants to tell me that she's gonna eat them not cooked. That's her plan. This is what she really wanted. So. So yeah, I think this is like pretty much everything we got. I just showed you the stuff that I found kind of interesting. Didn't find that many snacks, but we still have snacks from like two weeks ago. So I think they're gonna be okay for school. The final tally is da, 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 $323. Now that's in Canadian. Um, this is a little bit more than what we usually spend. Like usually I spend about $150 a week on food, groceries a week. They'd be like around 150, right? So this is a bit more, but I feel like we can make this last. Like we're gonna freeze a lot of this stuff. Thank you for coming to Costco with us. Tell us in the comments what you like to buy at Costco. Maybe there's something that I missed that you think is really good that we should try. And how much do you usually spend at Costco? You know. So thank you for coming and uh, thanks for watching. Never give up. <laughs>